And we have seen some big matches here in the past couple of uh, couple of wrestle rings, but I mean, this is this one definitely does seem it, like it's you know kind of put apart from the other ones. I think this one feels like an even bigger match. This is something that the the crowd in Texas would love to see, has been like raving for it for so long. And of course, here at wrestle ring, why not? Exactly. And Aaron Mercer put out the challenge at the end of our last show. We didn't know who was going to step up to the plate. The fact that it's high on doing it. Oh, okay. I don't know why he would toy with Hyon. That, that doesn't seem smart. Yeah, everything that I've seen of Hyon, she's not the person that you want to try to play head games with because she will play them right back. See, even to her stance, it's just different. Everything is just so calculated now. And this crowd is split between the two. Well, whenever you think of Tex Texas wrestling, these two names are definitely up at the top of the list as those defining the movement right now. So to have them in the same contest, Aaron Mercer taking high on down from that. You know, and these two are very equally uh, matched when it comes to skill set, but I think the only thing that Hyon really has over Mercer that she can really lord over him is the distance traveled, the, the, the miles that she's put in. Yeah, Hyon has definitely been all over the world, trained and traveled. But in terms of in-ring ability, these two are very, very evenly matched, both in striking ability and in technical prowess. And you're seeing a lot of that technicality right now. Aaron Mercer, who has more than proved himself in different situations, has moved on from the deathmatch mentality that we saw him throughout the course of the last few years. He's left death matches behind and is now trying to prove himself as something else entirely. And in a matchup with someone like Hyon, he's definitely got the opportunity to showcase what he can truly do. Oh! Aaron Mercer stopping Hyon in her tracks. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Well, Aaron Mercer does have an attitude. He's not going to change that. You know what? See, I was going to say, so does Hyon, though. She, she hits... She can get volatile, and when she does, she gets violent. Yeah, I've seen Hyon take on different types of opponents. I've seen her. Oh, is Mercer basically giving her a free shot? Oh, okay. Very solid chop. Hyon uh, has some of the hardest chops in the business. Mercer's, oh, not impressed with that first one, but that second one got him. If he keeps giving her free shots, he's going to get his chest caved in. Ooh, that one stopped with a dead thud. And now she seems to be challenging him back. Oh, no. Mercer says bring it on. Ooh, yeah, that did, that did kind of chop him down there. <laughs> I've seen... Oh, okay. I was going to say, I've seen high on go toe-to-toe. -to -toe with larger, imposing opponents before. She's no stranger to intergender contest. She competed against Stephen Wolf at New Texas Pro Wrestling not too long ago. In a hard hitting show. And there, head scissor takeover. And a drop kick to follow up. High on, going full steam ahead. She might be going to the outside. I think she's calling it. Uh-oh. Move, move, folks. Yep. Tope Suicida from Hyon. Taking Mercer down. Hyon is here for that championship. Hyon does not play around when there is gold on the line. I've never seen her give anything less than 110% in championship situations. Hyon going off that second rope, nailing the knee to the side of the head. Oh, my God. Oh, back chop, front chop, and high on is down. Aaron Mercer Ooh. showcasing that striking ability that he has honed over the last several years. It looks like high on is trying to catch her breath a little bit. And Mercer almost toying with her. Mercer going to drive the wind right out of her body like that. It's getting in the face of our official. 
You know, Jacob, you brought up that uh, Hayat never steps down from a uh, an intergender match. She's a wrestler's wrestler. She will wrestle absolutely anybody that challenges her. And, I mean, of course she was going to answer this call. There's a championship on the line. One more, you know, to add to the prestige that she already has. You know? Hayat is an is a oh. opportunity prize fighter. The... The fact that the lights are shining brighter here at WrestleRave with the championship on the line, that is just fuel to the fire for someone like Hyon. And Aaron Mercer, he knows that a win against someone like Hyon, who is so world traveled, is going to say, Ooh. Oh, as he lays in yet another chop, that's going to say oh, so know. much to the, legiti the legitimacy of his championship reign. You look at who he's already taken down. You look at his defenses against Shota Suzuki, against Big Boss, and now Hyon. Just a string of title defenses that would make any champion shine brighter. And here, Aaron Mercer is looking to just... Oh! Oh! And there's the speed of Hyon coming into play. Aaron Mercer has got to stay on his toes here. Both competitors not letting each other go. Hyan not giving up. Neither is Mercer, but she gets him up and over. Yeah, Mercer planted hard, center of the ring. Hyan working with that energy from the crowd. Waiting for Mercer. Oh, Mercer playing possum a bit. Just explodes out with that Larry. Mercer did not come to play around either. That championship means the world to him. You know, with every title defense, I think it just adds more and more to how much we we need to put eyes on Aaron Mercer. As he goes for cover one, two, kick out by high on. I've said it multiple times, Jacob. You don't get the name Blood of Texas doing nothing. You have to earn it, and he has absolutely earned that title. Absolutely. Aaron Mercer has put oh. respect on his own name. The thing that you have to worry about as these defenses rack up and as he makes a name for himself is he can't let that go to his head. You see how cocky Aaron Mercer can get. He can't let that be his downfall as Hyon fires off here. Counter by Mercer into the ropes. Stopped. Hyon gets that boot up. Body takes Mercer down. Now Mercer's starting to feel that little bit of struggle. Oh, and look at this. Look at the power of Hyon. Oh! Deep leg drop into the cover. Hooks the leg. Two counts. Hyon is such a dangerous opponent. Mercer starting to get up to more of a vertical base. Hyon's gonna help him get there. She is, she is trying to she's trying to end this. Oh, but Mercer! Quick, quick oh. counter by Mercer drives her into the corner. Oh, and those and thudding just, chops just unloads. Oh. You can see the pain in her face, folks. Oh no! And now Mercer got her tied up in the corner there. Oh, this just seems disrespectful. Well, Mercer knows how to put the hurt on an opponent. He is a very psychological opponent. Well, we we talked about how Mercer has moved beyond the deathmatch mentality, but that doesn't mean he's not a violent individual as Hyon works her way out of that corner, off the ropes, ducks the clothesline. Oh, gets up on Mercer. Oh! Brings him down. One, two. Oh. Shoulder up. Almost had a new champion Woo. right there. And that's how quickly the tide can turn, especially whenever you've got someone like Hyon, who whenever they see gold on the line, nothing else matters. I guarantee Aaron was sweating on that one. Hyon might be calling for it. Might say this thing's over. Mercer putting the brakes on. Both of them trying to get something out of it. Oh! 
high back body drop. Now high on trying to throw strikes. Mercer still not impressed, but it's, I mean, both these competitors are tired. They have worn each other out at this point. Well, they're throwing everything they can at each other. Now, high on with those hard elbow strikes. That one might have rocked him a bit. Oh! Double overhand chop and high on crumples. Almost immediately. Good God. Just a sheer force and aggression from Aaron Mercer. Now Mercer has high on up. But high on trying to find a way out of it, throwing those elbows, creating separation. Back in the corner goes high on. Oh. Oh! One, two. Oh! She had her she had her arm up and she she broke breaked. Woo! Just that was Woo! That was very close, y'all. Reaching for every opportunity she has to stay back in this thing. Woo! Man. And the crowd, you can see them. They are they all feel that that little bit of a clinch. Mercer, who is usually universally beloved in this building, getting a little bit of flack from the crowd here at WrestleRave as he ascends to the top rope. Mercer looking for God knows what. Mercer! Oh! Flying senton! High on getting the legs up. And now, is she going to go? It looks like she's going to try to... It looks like she's going to try to land that beauty sleep. Uh-oh. Mercer able to counter out. Cross body by High on. Caught by Mercer. Oh. Oh. Went for a power slam. High on rolled through it. Used the, the momentum against him. Oh. That's got to be it. One, two, three. Wow. Winner of this match. Everybody in this building is probably very disappointed to hear Cher right now. It's probably the first time that's ever been said. Yeah, I 